welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Nassine. I'm 38, I'm kind of a nerd. I play video games, but this is on a whim. I'm not makeup My I'm homesick tooth hurt but anyways keto crate and it's an exciting video so i wanted to kind of just make it and get it out of the way and get it up as soon as i can but keto crate reached out to me and they asked me if i would like to receive their box for free and go over it on video and that is so exciting who doesn't want a ton of awesome freaking treats from keto crate if you have been to my channel for any amount of time like i think it was about a year ago i actually subscribed to keto crate and i had to cancel it just because i was going through some stuff and i couldn't really afford it at the time but i i really did like it i've gotten some of my favorite things out of the keto crates in the past that i did i think i i got like three keto crates and in those three keto crates there was always something like i really 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 liked like i got my catalina crunch out of there or i had my macadamia milk out of there um i've had there there's so many things like new types of candy bars and just so many things so i've not opened this lid i've un unlatched it i have untaped it and i am ready to open it up and see what's inside all right so first things first i open it up there's a lot in here it's got oh my god there is a lot in here i don't remember there being this many this much stuff in it so september 2020 keto crate it's got stories recipes Ooh, actually that sounds really good um deli roll with punchies whatever that is um quick and crispy pepperoni chips uh avocado chocolate pudding there's all different kinds of things in this here which i really like i might try that avocado pudding oh link has come to visit hi linky um next thing that's on top Ooh. Uh, when did they do that? This is a, apparently this is at Walmart. I didn't know about this. This is the sugar that I use all the time with, made with erythritol. I'm sorry, I got a piece of fuzz in my nose. It says it's at Walmart and Amazon. A chocolate drink mix. Are you kidding me? I need that. I didn't know. Ah! <laughs> all right. I didn't know. And uh, I thought this was just an advertisement, but this actually included in there. So I can actually try that. I'm excited. I'm very excited to try that. So this is the first thing that I'm gonna bring out. I cannot believe how much stuff is in this. So the first thing is uh, this pure sugar-free chocolate drink mix. One little packet, you just mix in your milk, your almond milk, your whatever alternative you're gonna use. It's 10 calories, no fat, um, no sodium. It's four total carbs with one fiber, so and two uh, erythritol and one protein. Not bad. I'll definitely be probably trying that today. Next thing that I pull out is this um, Tomer Kosher Chicago's Beef Stick. This is, uh, a, who doesn't love beef sticks? This is zero grams of sugar, seven grams of protein, 90 calories, gluten-free, no nitrate. Who doesn't love a beef stick? Hopefully it's good. 90 calories, I like that. All right, next thing I'm gonna pull out, good to go. I've had these good to go bars and I do like them. They are more, um, good to go actually sent me some of their bars. They are more, I want to say like cookie like the consistency of these. They're very cookie ish. And, um, I've actually had the cinnamon pecan and it was one of my favorites. This is 14 grams of fat. It's 16 total carbs with seven grams of fiber, five erythritol and five protein. I, I really like these. The next thing that's jumping out to me is this sunflower seed dip and spread. Um, it's keto verified. It's one net carb per serving. There is um, four servings in this and a serving size is two tablespoons, 110 calories, 10 grams of fat, two total carbs, one gram of fiber. Interesting. Oh, and this is garlic, garlic flavored. Ingredients are water, sunflower seeds, sunflower oil, granulated garlic, salt, balsamic vinegar, citric acid, lemon peel powder. Interesting. Interesting. Can you see that? Next thing that is jumping out to me is whatever the heck this is. Bright Fox, which this packaging is a little, I mean, the packaging is really cute, but this using this um lime green on here you cannot see it i do not know how well that is picking up on camera because i can barely see it with my own eyes but it says nightlife hydration beverage for a brighter tomorrow cucumber and mint 
no calories, one total carb, no protein, no fat. Interesting. I really don't, I would like more information, but I can barely even read the ingredients. It's just Bright Flax is a delicious way to stay hydrated, made with a scientifically formulated mix of vitamins, minerals, electrolytes, and antioxidants that optimize your night and brighten your morning. So apparently you're supposed to drink this at night. I don't know. Interesting. I would say Bright Fox, if for whatever reason you may be watching this, I would definitely work on the, the font coloring because that, that hurt my eyeballs. Um, next thing I pull out, Be Lean Bars with Benefits. Jimmy Protein Bar. This is strawberry nut keto friendly bars. 15 total carbs. I'm sorry, 15 grams of fat. 16 total carbs, 11 grams of fiber. 210 calories. Next thing I'm pulling out. Dang coconut chips, unsweetened, toasty crunch, one gram of sugar per serving, lightly salted, they say they're keto, seven total carbs, four grams of fiber, one gram of protein, 12 grams of fat, 130 calories. You know what, I'm gonna go ahead and try this right now. I'm actually interested. All right, I like that. Lightly salted, it was very strange. The serving size is 0 0.7 ounces, 20 grams. And so this whole bag. What's really weird about this is I kind of taste the coconut, but not a lot. I more taste a little bit of the salt, but it, it almost reminds me of like a Pringles, like an original Pringles with just a hint of coconut. It's so weird. I like this. Link, Link likes it too. Um, next thing that I'm pulling out is these better than good veggie infused protein grab and go puffs baked cheddar 110 whoop, 110 calories four total fat it's really hard to see it hold on it's glued to the side all right 110 calories four total fat three grams total carb no fiber so this Three carbs, yeah, it's three carbs. I kind of opened it there, but I don't want to open it all the way. Interesting, but you know what? Since I already opened it and let some of the air out, we'll go ahead and try one, because a lot of the time these protein buffs can be kind of like gritty. They smell really good. It's a little, a little gritty, but it's not too gritty that I couldn't eat it, like with the shrewd food ones, and the taste is on point. That is very good. It tastes like a Cheeto puff. Like a legit Cheeto puff. I, I do like that. Next thing that I am grabbing out. Roasted sunflower kernels, tamari, and apple cider vinegar. These are 15 total fat, 6 total carbs with 3 fiber, and 6 grams of protein. Serving size, a fourth cup. So this is two servings. Interesting. Confused what that flavor would taste like. Next thing I pull out. IQ bar, almond butter chip. I have an IQ bar, but it's kind of like smashed and somebody gave it to me and I've never tried it. This is three net carbs for the bar. 150 calories, 17 total carbs, eight grams of fiber, 12 grams of protein. Dairy free for those of you that are dairy, oh my God. For those of you that are dairy free, um, no sugar alcohols, it's soy free, no GMO, gluten free, complete protein and it's kosher. So IQ bar. Next thing I'm pulling out, oh yes, I'm so excited to see what's underneath that. Um, <laughs> oh, I'm always happy to see this. This is um, Strive Beef Biltong. This is air-dried beef slices. Nope, no, uh, no total sugars. There's 90 calories per serving. If you did eat the whole container, it's 190 calories for the whole container and one total carb for the whole container and 36 grams of protein if you just had one serving, which is one ounce, then it is uh, no carbs, 16 grams of protein. So I always love beef jerky. This is what I'm excited to see. And I can tell you that I actually like flackers because I have this at my desk. These ones are the savory flackers. This is the sea salt flackers. I've not been able to find this. The only kind that I can find at the store are the savory ones but I really, really like flackers, and these ones are the sea salt. So I, I, these are so good. You can, they're very fulfilling too. They really fill you up, and they're made with flaxseed. 
literally the ingredients organic flaxseed organic apple cider vinegar and sea salt that's it and they're really good and so they do have a nice amount of protein they have a nice amount of fiber it's 12 grams of fat 10 total carbs 9 dietary fiber 6 grams of protein and uh, the calories are 160 and that's for 10 crackers i really 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 like crackers. i think they're really good and then the last thing in here is this intake crunchy cheese spicy i've had intake before but not the spicy and i really liked it intake is a pretty good brand i compare them probably to very similar to like moon cheese if you've ever had that if you haven't big lots usually sells it and these are for 18 to 20 pieces six grams of total fat less than one gram of total carbs and five grams of protein these are good i like putting them on top of salads you can have it as a snack you can put it on top of chili you can put it in a soup at, instead of a cracker these are really really good so my box is empty and i'm really excited about this i actually have a link that you guys can save money when you purchase keto crate if you want to purchase it too and yeah i'm excited to try a lot of these new snacks stay tuned in my videos to see how i feel about some of the ones that i didn't try in the video today i'm really curious about this i know it says it's a nighttime drink but i feel like maybe i'm bright fox i've never even heard of that should i just try it i can't even open it okay there it goes Let's see. Jeez. all right it's very rough to open it smells it smells good but it's almost almost smells like an energy drink of something what is this flavor cucumber and mint i don't taste any mint and i'm not sure if i taste cucumber i don't taste cucumber it almost tastes like a pickle to be honest it kind of tastes like pickle juice that is I, I would have imagined that to be extremely refreshing, a cool cucumber taste with like a little bit of minty, but, and I like pickle juice, but that's not what I expect it to be. It definitely tastes like you're drinking a salty cucumber, which is a pickle. So I don't know, I'm, I'm not into that too much. Not super. But I'll tell you this, without trying everything else, I really like these. You wanna try one? Off camera, Reese is gonna try one. I'm down for these. What do you think? Link, you're hitting my camera. What do you think about it? He approves. All right, guys, that's all I got for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Look forward to seeing these videos once a month with Keto Crate. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.